it. No gunshots, but they get in. Yo, what's going on guys, it's True Bubba here. Welcome back to another video. As you can tell, we're playing some CSGO for this video. Um, just before the video actually starts, or before I actually start commentating about whatever, uh, I my computer, it's not the greatest. So I'm probably only going to be able to record in about 30 FPS, so I'm pretty sorry about that, but hopefully you guys can bear with me until I actually do save up. Until I get a really decent computer, it'll be in ages, just saying guys. But for now... This computer is uh, what we've got, and it records about 30 FPS, but, um, yeah. So, pretty much, yeah, I'm on CSGO. Uh, I've never actually made a video on this uh, game before, so, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it, because, um, I'm not the greatest in the world, as you guys can see. I'm already getting destroyed by pretty much everyone in, in this deathmatch lobby, um, but, yeah. I do really want to start making more CSGO videos, just the only problem is, um, with making these videos, I can't really record competitive uh, games because uh, when I play, I do get like by, without recording, I do get about like 60 FPS or like around that. So like without recording, just playing. So I do like want to play well. So and when you're on a lower FPS, you're not going to perform as well. But so for now, uh, my videos on CS:GO will probably consist of um, deathmatch, probably surfing, and uh, auto b-hop servers like death run and stuff, but uh, yeah. But pretty much I don't really know what to talk about this video, so the fact that I'm actually going to be starting to record some CSGO videos, but if you guys can't tell, I don't actually have my face cam on, uh, I'm sorry about that because um, I just can't really use it, because uh, it's going to, oh, if I try to record it's going to make my um, video, like it's going to lower the quality of the FPS even more. I don't really want that. As you guys can tell on this game, like I don't really have any good skins. I used to have a really expensive AK skin, and but then I traded it for this um, knife that I have. It's a flip knife over mass field tested. I like put it on CSGO Wild and it's like bidding and stuff and then like got a knife. So I was pretty happy about that, but I'll probably, um, get a better knife eventually, uh, maybe I'll bid it as well, but I'm not entirely sure yet to be honest. Now, I'm not the greatest at this game, my CSGO rank is on like Silver Elite, because I only recently got my rank, and I've only been playing this game for like a month or two or something like that, it hasn't been that long, like it's been ever since the holidays that I actually started playing on this game, and ever since I got it, I haven't regretted buying it, this game is extremely fun. I like the way it runs, the movement, and I like the fact that there's all these really uh, cool skins and stuff you can get, like cases and stuff. I have watched videos and that and on this before, but the way I actually got this knife is, um, I guess this is what the title of the video is, how I got my knife. So um, pretty much uh, when I very first started CSGO, it was kind of early on, and um, I pretty much earned a revolver case in-game, and like oh, thanks, what you man. usually do when you have a, a Sorry, case is like you open it with a key which is about three dollars seventy New Zealand and so I ended up uh, buying the key and I opened it now pretty much what I ended up getting was um quite amazing I got a um, stat track AK 47 point disarray uh, it was field tested and it was worth uh, like seventy dollars at the time so ever since I got that, I used it, I got about 200 and something kills on it, but I was just like, oh man, this is like worth as much as some uh, knives, like a flip felcher knife like I have, and I'm like, man, I really do want to get a knife, so I'll probably just like, I don't know, try trade it or something like that. Now obviously, there's like CSGO Lounge and stuff like that, but nobody really wanted to like get my knife, like get my gun for a knife, so... I pretty much, I put my gun into CSGO Wild, and um, when you put your gun into CSGO Wild, you have to bet like 30% of your um, gun into the website. So once I did that, I uh, I made, I went from um, 44 gems to uh, 50, and the knife was pretty cool. I think the knife was like 45, so... Yeah, I, I had, I was lucky, I did some bidding, I, the risk paid off, and I got myself a knife. To be honest, yes, I know, I am pretty terrible at this game, and I have a knife. It's not something that would usually happen, but, yeah, I have a knife, I'm pretty happy about the fact that I have a knife, and, 
yeah, it's pretty cool because you can sometimes balance it on your hand. But yeah, I guess that's all that's really going to happen for the CSGO uh, commentary. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit the thumbs up. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll be recording more CSGO in the future. Probably doing some B-hop or uh, surfing with my mates. Uh, probably with Psych or um, Law maybe. And I'll probably just like do some videos on that, like funny fails or something like that. But yeah, I guess this is all it has for the video. It's been True Puppy, and I'm Sana, guys. Peace.